welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is a get ready with me and i'm going to answer some questions i asked you guys on instagram stories and here on youtube to send in some of your questions if you have any and um, yeah i'm going to be answering them while doing my makeup so i'm sitting here in my bedroom um, at my makeup table and i'm hoping that the light is okay um, this is not like the brightest room so i hope it's okay but yeah, let's get started with my makeup. Okay, so let's start with the first question. How have you been? So thank you so much for asking that question. Um, yes, I'm doing fine. Um, the weather has been lovely here in uh, Marmaris, Turkey. So we've been out a lot, which is just great. The sunshine always makes you feel a lot better. Um, my husband needs to start working again soon so that will be a change because then um, he's working every single day again so then I will be like solo parenting because he works from the morning till late in the evening so that will be again a little bit of a switch for me because he's been home a lot and then I just need to adjust everything um, and get used to doing everything alone again and last year it was absolutely fine but yeah it is a lot more work obviously if you are alone um, all day long so I will just enjoy our time together now before he goes um, back to work and tomorrow my husband and I are married for eight years it's our wedding anniversary tomorrow which just blows my mind that also means that I'm living in Turkey for over eight years um yeah where has the time gone and we will be celebrating that tomorrow um which i'm also looking forward to so the next question is your ultimate mom life hack so i'm not really sure if it's like a hack or more advice um but be kind to yourself being a mom can be really overwhelming and especially in the first few months i wanted to do everything perfect and wanted to stay on top of everything because looking back sometimes i think i was like in survival mode and um you just take everything very slow sleep when the baby sleeps and i'm still doing that because um we haven't slept one full night since axel is born Axel still wakes up at least three or four times at night, at least. And in the beginning, I was like, I need to get the washing load in. I need to do this. I need to do that. But just try to enjoy it because the time does go by so fast. Um, it's really true what they say. And also ask for help because your mental health is also very important. Um, there's nothing wrong with asking for help. If you are tired and you know, and my husband was a big help for me, especially in the beginning. Axel was born in October, so we had quite a few months together. And um, yeah, he was a big help. And like I mentioned, my husband goes back to work soon. So I don't know if it's really a hack, but if you are solo parenting or if you are a single parent, um, try to do everything in the first nap. Axel naps in the morning and in the afternoon. And I try to get most of the things done in the first nap, so right now. And then in the second nap, I can also lay down for a bit. And also some things I do together with Axel, like put the washing load in and um, vacuuming. He really enjoys that. So try to get a bit of cleaning done together with your baby or toddler. Um, Axel really likes to help me. So that's also maybe a little bit of a hack. The next question is, how did you regain your ideal weight after giving birth and how do you always maintain it? So when I was pregnant, I had gestational diabetes. If you are around 20 weeks pregnant, I believe, I'm not really sure now, you have to drink glucose. I believe glucose is that the English word for it. But um, they test if you have gestational diabetes, pregnancy um, sugar. And unfortunately, I had gestational diabetes. Um, which I was quite surprised by because, because I didn't eat loads of sugars. But my doctor told me that it's about your hormones. So I needed to follow a very strict diet. I couldn't eat any sugars or carbs. And that's how I didn't gain any weight. In fact, I lost weight. And um, I only gained 4 kilos in my whole pregnancy. Which is like the craziest thing. So only Axel gained weight and I lost weight. 
So after Axel was born, I was actually six kilos down than I was like before my pregnancy. And I was very shocked by that because my pants just dropped down, like my clothes didn't fit me anymore. And um, the biggest thing was that my milk didn't really come in. Okay, so this is a very long story, but I was nursing Axel almost all day long. And yeah, my milk just didn't come in. And after I gave birth, I started to eat everything again. So all of the carbs, all of the sugars. And I also to started to gain back that weight. So now that Axel is almost 18 months old, I am back on my pre-pregnancy weight, I believe. <laughs> but I do carry my weight a bit different after giving birth. Like my belly is a bit more soft and uh, my hips are a bit more wide. And I don't follow a diet or anything, but I do try to work out a few days a week. So yes, that was a very long story, but um, yeah, if you want to lose weight, definitely try to cut out all of the sugars and carbs because that's the way. Although I don't think it's healthy because like I said, my milk didn't come in and I was just too thin um, because all of my life I am around the same weight. And that time I just lost six kilos, which was like crazy. And then the next question is, how has your spring been so far? So yeah, really great. Um, we've been out a lot. The weather here in Marmaris is just so nice. Around 17 degrees um, during the day, which is just very lovely. And um, we've been on walks a lot. Axel has been playing outside and um, he loves to be outside. Um, I'm not going to do my mascara just yet. I'm going to use this um, pen which is from Gosh, and this is like an eyeshadow pen, which is just great if you want a quick eyeshadow look. And I can't wait to go swimming with Axel. Um, I think after a month or so, we can definitely start swimming in the sea. He loves it, he loves to be in the water, so I'm sure he will love it as well. And then the next question is, do you have any travel plans? So yes, we want to go um, in October, the end of October, to the Netherlands uh, to visit my family. So like I mentioned, my husband will work till mid-October. So I'm looking to tickets to go um, at the end of October and then till the end of November. So that will be very nice and yeah, I will keep you guys posted on that. I'm also excited to vlog a bit while we are there. So yeah, this is my quick everyday makeup look. And thank you so much for all of the questions. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give the huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye.